What's going on everybody and welcome back to Metro Exodus the two canals um, I believe that's how you say it if I'm saying it wrong I'm gonna hate myself in the future and people will laugh at me because I'm saying it wrong but whatever uh, we're back here and uh, yeah so we just went to see we are going to now spend time with my family uh, I think my Come son on, that's, uh, that's pretty cool so, yeah. This DLC, as I said, is a lot shorter. Sir, there's too many people in the way. You can't really go through. You'd better go up through the restaurant and get to the gallery for. I have to go up to the restaurant then. <laughs> Great disguise, Private. Though I must ask, where is your Citra? Oh, the mission of helping prepare the celebration is almost accomplished. There's just one light bulb remaining, sir. At ease, Private. I'll help you. Happy New Year, Dad. I didn't think you'd make it in time. You were late for my birthday. And Mom's anniversary, too. You see... I was just doing my best to make sure there were as few sad anniversaries in other families as possible. Oh, I understand. Good to hear that. Now, turn it on! Mission accomplished! Good job, Private! Thank you. Oh, Dad, I have something for you. Here, with Rubik's help me fix it. Oh, thank you, son. Is the kid. Speaking of Petrovich, mm. as soon as the official celebration is over, all personnel are to wash their faces and arrive at Petrovich's place wearing dress uniform. Yay! Arrive at Petrovich's clean face and dress uniform. Roger that, Corona, sir. Wow. So we're playing as Krull's so dad. Yes, listen. So yeah, we're playing as Krell's dad. Krell was in the main game. You and the uh, RTM and the Colonel find him. This is the year before. <laughs> yeah, so we're playing as Krell's dad. Citizens, 
This is six months later now after. May I, General? Oh. Sir. Not funny, Slava, and I'm not in the mood for jokes. What's up at Sibirskaya? We're all done there, and this is what we got. It's not much. This is bad. We're in the middle of a fallout spot. You'll we'll have to roast for 500 clicks at the very least. Your guys brought a bunch of maps, but there are no really safe areas on any of them. I had hopes for it. Still looking for Baikal. The archive is trashed. As for the radiation, that's what the filters are for. Keeping the dust out. Filters. All the carriages are so radioactive, no filters will help us without the green stuff. There will be children too. You have a son yourself, so you know children need more. I know. Do we have enough? Not for everyone at once. First we'll evacuate the corp stop and then bring everybody else out so you mean we're going to split people into sorts the ones we say first and then the rest the dregs our children among all else what's there to discuss <laughs> didn't expect that from you of all people I for one thought about him you two will be leaving with the first train People can handle the prospect by themselves. All right. I want another smoke. How about you? Uh, I got work to do. Nah, that. I'll pass this time. So we're playing as Krell's dad, but also kind of following where Miller went. When they say the green stuff, by the way, it sounds like they're talking about marijuana. You know why we are here. I suggest you donate your excess stock voluntarily, or there will be trouble. Again? You know I can't do that. It is for my granddaughter. I have been saving from my own allowance. I can't do anything. We had a tip about your stock, and had to react to that. Commence the search. Check there. This is so unfair. I earned this. Saved my wages. I know, but we follow the rules. I found a cash sight. He does have some. I can't. Not too much here, though. My granddaughter is sick. She needs that. Sure, your granddaughter. Bye, but it's going to the market. Corn. Please, you know it's true. Sir, this can't be all he has stashed. We should search more. There's a Enough. We're only confiscating the excess stock. I'm not gonna take this but, sir, but we will have to report everything. Take this to HQ and report that stopping the search was my decision. Yes, sir. Look, I'm, I'm sorry. I know you didn't have a choice. Thanks for leaving me some. I'm sorry too. You were right about choice though. Nobody had it. I'll be going now. Don't mention it. 
Your quota wasn't captured out of Yeah, this is the moral choice. <laughs> I'm gonna just steal some guy's thing just so a kid can die, that's ridiculous. I'm gonna steal the guy's stuff, you know, that will result in his daughter most likely dying. You know, unless that's, that's a bit inhumane. And it's not like... Oscom, open up! Ah, hello there, Private. I'm completely drained. Kirill? Hmm. All right, Private. Tell me what's going on. You don't want what? Private. I don't want to be an Oscom anymore. Right. Please elaborate on that. I want to see Biraskaya, and I saw the soldiers taking green stuff from people. When one traitor, when I gave it to them, started shouting. They beat them up and took all the green stuff anyway. Well, this is just unacceptable. First thing tomorrow, I'm going to get their names. You said Oscom protects people, but you just take their green stuff away. Why? It's not easy. We're short on green stuff. That's why we must take from those who have lots of it and give to those who don't have enough. Or else the rich would just sit on their stock while the poor would all die. Could you call that fair? Not at all. Of course I couldn't call that fair. Right. Of course those who we take from aren't happy, but there's no other way, you see? Uh, if I had all my green stuff taken, I wouldn't be happy about that. But I understand now. Good. Still those soldiers were wrong. I'll make sure they are punished, and then they'll have to go and apologize. Yes, make them. They must apologize. Great. Speaking of green stuff, it's time we gave you a shot, so give me your arm. All right. happening ah current day Entering Sibirskaya. Was this where the last battle happened? Over. So it's like, yeah, it's like Miller exploring what happened. You know. The rioters are advancing. There's no time for rest. Basically, some people have gone rogue. Tell me that. If we, Oscom, are protecting people, why lie to them? Wow. You've grown up, Private. And I'm none the wiser. So, let's have a grown-up talk. Should we tell the truth? Of course. But life is a complex thing. In the hands of our enemies, truth may be dangerous. 
We must carefully choose who we can entrust with it and who we cannot. The command sees the whole picture and makes decisions. However unpleasant those decisions might be sometimes, they are still necessary. The command thinks about everyone, while the civilians only think about themselves. That is why the truth that might scare them must be kept secret for their own good. Do you understand that? I do, but still, this is a scary way of thinking. There are a lot of scary things in life, yet I brought you up well. You are strong and brave. You can take it. All right, time to go. You get home and don't step out or let anyone in until I'm back. It's an order. Yes, Colonel, sir. Sergeant, walk him home. Yes, sir. Let's go, Kirill. All right. Good luck, Dad. Good luck, son. Okay. So Yeah, at least we are actually able to use. It's gonna stick to that scoop. I have one in. No, I like that one. Um pretty much good to go. Uh, no, actually. Wait, wait, there's just one more thing I actually want to check. Oh no, that, this is the only two things, okay. Alright guys, I, I'm actually going to end the video here because it seems like there's going to be a big battle, so might as well end the video here. So thank you for watching, and yeah, I will see you in the next video. Bye.